Today's word is passion. Hi, Jonas Kane here, and welcome to Magic Words. It's my understanding that passion is what we have when we use our talents and skills to do something that matters to us. Now, Oprah Winfrey is, is quoted as saying, passion is energy. Feel the power that comes from focusing on what excites you. Of course, we all get excited about the things that make us truly come alive, the things that we think about even when we should probably be thinking about other things. Now, when I think about this kind of passion, I'm reminded of Harry Chapin, a man who, by the mid-1970s, was one of the highest paid musicians in the world, was selling out concert arenas every year, and while he was incredibly talented in music, what mattered to him most was helping the poor and the hungry. He saw hunger and poverty truly as an insult to America, and he became passionate about his work when he used his talents not to amass a fortune, but instead as a platform for social justice. He donated a third of his income, which was roughly $2 million a year, to charitable causes. And, and proceeds from the merchandise sold at his concerts were used to support World Hunger Year, a nonprofit that he co-founded that provides access to nutritious foods for the poor and education and resources for, for communities. Now, Harry's work even caught the attention of political activist and four-time presidential candidate Ralph Nader, who once said of Harry, I've never seen an entertainer who dedicated so many hours to a civic cause. That's the power that passion can offer you when your talents match your interests. Today's magic word then asks us these questions. Are you passionate about what you're currently doing? What matters to you? And how can you use your talents to help you work in the areas that matter most to you? Are there perhaps skills that you may need to cultivate? And finally, what can you do today to start living a more passion-driven life? Well, that's it for this edition of Magic Words. Until next time, my name is Jonas Kane. Stay positive.